Hey guys, Steve Walsh here, Pima Toyota in downtown Nashville. Uh, what you're looking at here is the two uh, most current of the uh, Highlander models. Uh, to your right over here, this is a 2019. Um, that body style goes all the way back to 26, actually 2017. Um, and it, that's when it had the refresh, but it goes back further from that, it goes back to 2014 uh, before the refresh. This is the 2020, 2021 will be the same. So why am I showing you these cars? And it's actually a really good reason. They both have something hidden in them. And there's very few people that realize it because your salesperson didn't know. If you had the Limited or the Limited Platinum in both of these, you actually have a gift. So what I'm going to show you, I'm going to open this one and I'm going to open this one. All right. What I'm going to show you is in the back area, you'll notice no matter what trim level of the Highlander that you have, you have these little squares on both sides. That's in the current one. That's in the previous one. All right. Still have your squares here. That's for what's known as a tonneau cover, cargo area cover, whatever you want to call it. If you look at like the XLE, you'll see that it's an option and you can buy the tonneau cover or cargo cover, whatever you want to call it. So you can buy that and it's an option. But here's the thing. There's been people that have bought that tonneau cover for when they have the limited or the platinum and not realized that it, it at least if you bought it new, it came with it. And chances are, if you bought it used, it probably has it. So this one's a used one, obviously, because I got the 2020s. If you pull this open, you're going to see this is the area where all the jack is and everything for your tire. So that, that way, if you drop your tire, you put everything down here to drop your tire. What you're going to notice, well, hell, what's this right here? You've actually got your tonneau cover right here. So you want to install your tonneau cover. Very easy. Put your square end in there. And I'm going to have to kind of finagle this with one hand here. But I'm going to show you. Push this button. You'll pop that out. Push this button. You'll pop this out. All right? So I'm going to put that in there. And I'm going to put that in there. You now have your tonneau cover that you didn't realize you had. All right? So that being said, what's different on the 2020? Oddly enough, not much. So... You lift this up, lift this up. Now it's still, everything looks the same, but look, you've also got your hidden tonneau cover. It's in the exact same spot, works the same way. The only difference is this tonneau cover is actually a little bit more lean and mean. It's actually lighter, feels a little bit easier to haul around, but everything else, when it comes down to it, you hit your button, that pops out, put that over there. Put this over here, which one-handed, it's always it's always fun one-handed, but still, like I said, it's it's easy enough that you can do it one-handed. And then you've got your tonneau cover. Once again, installs the exact same way. So you have your cargo cover here. You can cover the entire back end. When you want to put it back, slide her back in, hit this right here, push this boat. Actually, you don't even need to hit the buttons, by the way. Um, push those both back in. It's going to shorten this for you. At that point, you lift this back up. Always put your left side in first, just because that's the way you need to do it. Put your left side in, put your right side in. Would say shake it all about, but that would just be corny. So put that down there, and then you can put your cargo mat back down should you have one of those or your carpet back down should you have one of those but very easy you'll see even though this one's a little bit bulkier in the previous generation still everything works the same way take this slide that back get both of them locked in there and i hope i'm not bouncing around for you guys too much sorry if i am um, it's kind of hard to do some of this stuff one-handed but you'll kind of see here and then you want to pop this back in here all right, push this down, push it over, and you're down. All right, this right here will pop up. So if you need it to pop up, you can have it pop up. All right, 
Pop that down there. Pop this down. And then once you do that, roll your carpet back up. Like I said, you can have a carpet, you can have a mat, whatever you've got. But what you're noticing there is that it hides nice and neatly away. If it's up here, so what else I wanna show you, and I'm gonna pop over here and kinda, kinda walk at the same time. And I'm gonna open this one. This one's an XLE, all right? And we have all these boxes on here that have special codes to get into them, kind of like a realtor, which is kind of cool. So I'm gonna open the back end here. And there's a reason I'm doing this. So first off, I re this one has the back seats up. I'm just gonna fold those down just for effect here. Fold that one down, fold that one down. And I'm gonna show you that if you look in, this one's a brand new one as well. You're gonna see there's no cargo cover in there, no tonneau cover, but you still have the spot. So if you wanted to buy it or if you had an option, you don't have to sit with that cargo cover in a spot that's in your way. Let's put it that way. If you're, you know, always, there's some people that will pull those out and they'll actually put them in their garage and they'll forget about them. They get damaged, they get dusty, they get dirty, uh, spider webs. I mean, just, I mean, I've seen them come in on the used cars sometimes and I tell you what, sometimes you'd rather not have them, uh, just to be quite honest with you. But um, they, uh, if, if you like the tonneau cover, then definitely it's good to have it there. It's great for when you're shopping for Christmas, Christmas gifts, stuff like that, that you can actually cover the back end of your vehicle. And, and you know, that way if somebody's trying to get a peek inside and they're trying to look inside the car, which right now you can see it, obviously once you have that tonneau cover it covers whatever you put down here so that way you won't uh you won't uh, have to fight with uh you know somebody wanting to break into your car or something along those lines it just you know they don't know what's under it if anything's under it uh definitely keeping things out of sight out of mind is always better when it's uh time to consider what thieves would do of course so um like i said if you're in the limited or the limited platinum and uh, i say limited platinum because the previous generation of the highlander the 2014 and up the limited platinum still only said limited on the back but they actually changed it so um the new one and i can show you over here which is just where we were on the xle the new one will now say platinum on the back so but that's why i classified it as either limited or limited platinum when I was talking about those. So um, if you have the limited, the limited platinum or the platinum now, because they're differentiated, you're gonna have that tonneau cover as, as long as it was left in there, if it's a used car or if you're buying it new, you're gonna have that tonneau cover in the back of that car. So um, definitely it's, it's a great thing to have if you wanna use it. And uh, if you guys, uh, you know, had that question and, and keep in mind like i said if you buy one used and somebody might have had it as an option which was available the used ones of the previous generation the 14 through the 19 still had the the spot for it in the back so you could still have it in the back of there and be able to use that or buy one if you if you chose that that's uh, something that's important to you so uh, definitely wanted to show you guys that that way you know what you're what you're looking at and you know what you own like i said it could be a happy little secret that you didn't realize you had in the used car you just bought or even in the new car that you bought but your salesman didn't realize it so um which happens more times than i care to uh really point out other than the fact i just did so anyway once again steve watts with bima toyota I, I definitely appreciate you guys watching the videos liking the videos commenting um if you guys have a comment on this uh definitely i i want to know how many of you didn't know that you had that um so definitely comment there if you guys found out that you had it in your your highlander comment what year it was and uh how long you've owned it because i'm just kind of curious on uh how many of you guys might find out that you have the tonneau cover 
but you didn't realize it. So um, yeah, definitely give me a comment on those and uh, give me a like. I definitely appreciate all of those. But Steve Welch with Beeman Toyota in downtown Nashville. I hope you guys are having a great summer, uh, summertime down here as I'm recording this. Beautiful out. So um, definitely let me know what you guys think. But uh, you know whether you have the new one, the used one, uh, or obviously anything in between. Um, more than happy to help you guys out. If you're looking for a car, definitely come down here. Uh, I'll work with you. I'll make sure you have a great time buying a car. We uh, definitely have some fun when we're working together. So um, Steve Welch, Beamer Toyota in downtown Nashville. Once again, coming to you. Uh, I am master certified. I am the one that's going to help you. And uh, I want to make sure that you guys get a car and that, understand, and that you understand it when you get it to the house. So, uh, And if you don't, I'm going to make sure that uh, I'm available to you so that you can always reach out to me and we'll go over them again. So Steve Welch, Beamer Toyota. You guys have a great day. We'll talk to you guys soon.